There is a mountain of personal growth literature and business wisdom out there telling us what we should do to be successful. We know the concepts. Why do we find ourselves tongue-tied with the boss? Why do we find ourselves losing our tempers with our teams or even our families at the end of a tough day? What's happening? It doesn't seem logical. We believe that developing effective and authentic relationships is critical to having a successful career and to having a fulfilling life. We take people through the four stages of cultivating emotional agility so that they can apply this to their lives and their careers immediately. Now in the awareness stage, what we do is we help people understand how emotional triggers kick in faster than the speed of thought and what happens with these across the business landscape and in their personal lives. In emotional ownership, we help people zero in on precisely what triggers them, how it might have their roots in their signature power style and how to pause under pressure. In the interaction stage, we help people understand what triggers other people and how other people might feel about themselves in their presence. And then finally, in the integration stage, we give people a fresh perspective on balancing their personal goals and their professional responsibilities so they cultivate the emotional resilience they need to minimize their vulnerability to any kind of trigger. Understanding this four-stage process helps people align themselves with organizations that reinforce their core values and when necessary, make a healthy break with those that don't. We've worked through this four-stage process with senior executives, CEOs, people in the C-suite. They really need to understand how the relational nuances of how we deal with other people in terms of pacing, body language, impact their strategic decision-making and the way that they can build powerful professional alliances for others. But for many years, a lot of this work has also been the secret handshake because people really weren't taking this down and offering it to mid and perhaps entry-level employees. Lots of people are reinventing their careers more and more rapidly nowadays, and this emotional agility helps them do that strategically and not reactively. <music>